Hello everyone, this is Softex Sahal and today we will learn Application Studio in Kinetic version. Application Studio in Kinetic version is a new tool which is provided to design existing form or new form and uh, today we will see how to design any form. In that we will just add one button and we will see how to add the button in the existing form. So basically there are two ways to open application studio so first is obviously search so that you can go to the menu and search application studio it will open like this it will show you the list of the all screens available in the kinetic version so here if you you can see this is abc code entry the layer name is a customization name which is base so if we customize any screen we need to attach or publish the layer which will we, we will see how to attach that okay so likewise this is a screen and you can click on that base and it will open into the application studio okay second one second uh, way to open the application studio is select any form like code entry I am selecting open the code entry and uh, we can try to open in the kinetic version so new opportunity in kinetic version go to three dots click on the three dots and there is the application studio so this is a map application studio map here you can see all the tabs available in this code entry form like uh, details then lines line details and etc things so where we want to add or design the form so if i say that in the detail i want to add something so you have to click on that tab okay there is one button edit click on the edit or uh, there is a pen sign you can click on that so it will come the forms okay in the forms we need to add something so if you go to the right side there is a toolbox so same toolbox box available in the 10 also 9 also so here there is a new way i am just adding one button for uh, testing so i'm just click drag and drop okay so i have added same go to the pro properties click properties so you can give the ID so PTN test click so this way we can add the elements and design the form as we want so here you can see all the list of the elements available in the kinetic version and uh, this way we can add all the elements in the customization so now we will click on the save button and here you can see the new layer we need to create okay so in the kinetic version it's allowed to create a layer okay so we will create a layer there is a device type and there is a company name all so we can save the layer and now we need to publish this layer there is a preview button we can click on that preview button and then we will see on the runtime execution of the customization whatever we have developed so now i am going to click on the new code and then we can see able to see that button which already added okay now if you see in the button when i am clicking there is no functionality available okay i am going to add that functionality okay so here we will add one function and uh, just populate one message box and it will show the message box so how we will going to add in previous version you know it's uh, we need to create a code and we need to give the message box dot show and it will show the message box in the kinetic version it's a different way it's already available we need to just uh, attach that or we need to just activate that so how we will going to add this click on the button okay 
and then we need to go to the properties and in the behavior we need to add the uh, on click function click on the plus button and this is the flowchart you can see okay and then uh, in this flowchart we will going to add the action so here you can see list of the actions available like console dialog box functions etc so now we will take only a dialog box because we need to just print the message box right so click on that dialog box okay go to the advanced there is advanced and there is a parameter so go to the advanced select the parameter and in that parameter there are a list of the things available we need to give like type like type there is a list of the type we will select alert and then we will give the actual message we need to print that message okay so we need to give that the message and then we will click on the save button after the save button we will preview that our function and action is activated or not so we will just run our function uh, our layer and then we will click on the new button and just click on that button and you can see the function is working the information uh, is a alert box it's populated and whatever we give the message you clicked me this message is showing okay so this is it uh, for now uh, and uh, in the next time we will see how to add multiple uh, elements and we will try to properly design one customization and one form and then we will add functions how to write the functions how to attach that and lot of things we will see in that session inshallah okay thank you so much and uh, i hope you understand thank you so much